Assalamu alaikum warahmatullah. Gentlemen, this is the Blackboard test question generator. It's what I promised to share with you the other day after the Blackboard session. Uh, so basically, there are three steps to this. Number one is here, where you um, create the test. And this is the link that I'm going to share with you under the video, inshallah. Okay. So you create the test here. That is step one. You download it, of course. The second is to upload it to Blackboard, and the third one is to deploy it. Okay, uh, so let's go ahead and create a test. So, this is a quiz that I downloaded from online. All I need to do is just copy, copy, and paste that. Copy, let me go to Blackboard again, uh, no, not Blackboard, but to the, um, the generator here, and then paste that. Okay. Now, one important thing, what you need to have is only the questions, okay? I will leave this for now so that you can see what the problem is. And uh, let me name that quiz Farouk, okay? Good. Let's go ahead and generate it. See, we have three problems here you can't have a text like that delete it here um, you need to add an asterisk by the correct question that way the generator will understand that this is the correct answer so um, here I know it is C so I'm gonna go ahead and add that and then here the answer is uh, all the above it is D okay good let me go ahead and generate again all is fixed except for the first one number C okay now you need to have only one line of, for the answer let me go ahead and delete that for now okay generate the text all is good to go now step number one is done added the quiz added asterisk by the correct answers download the, uh, the questions second step is uploading the quiz to blackboard uh, when you log into your account you go to assignments and then sorry it says off here this is the students platform so I'm gonna go ahead and click on that so go to assessment test create let's call that quiz Arif, okay go ahead and submit that now we created the quiz we upload the questions because it's already downloaded remember let's put two points for each question go ahead and browse uh, we called it There was no space. Yep, here. So go ahead and upload that, submit. Now it is submitted. Okay, and this is our quiz. Click on OK. Now for the last step, you go under assignment again and test. Quiz four, uh, sorry, quiz Farouk, and then submit. Now these are the test options. You go ahead and make some changes, like um, you will need to make it available, right? And then it's very important that you set the time. Let's say fifteen minutes. That's up to you. And then the date and time which is very important if you make it just available and leave it there then students will have access to it 
but you need to set up the time and date and it's better to set a password too once all of that is done you go ahead and what and click on submit okay now there it is now if you want to see that in action go and make it uh, click on on now this is the students platform if you go ahead and click on quiz one then you are ready to do it now this is you trying it out okay but of course this won't happen by students because in your case you will have password already set and uh, you know as I said days and times okay now when you actually um, have the uh, quiz administered then you ask your students to log in go to assignments and then um, this is what they will see thank you very much